वेलकम टू आवर चैनल बी ऑलवेज लर्नर वीडियो में हम चैप्टर 2 पॉलीनोमियल एक्सरसाइज 2.4 क्वेश्चन नंबर 1 कवर करेंगे आपको वीडियो पसंद आएगा आप लाइक करिए शेयर करिए चैनल को सब्सक्राइब करिए तो फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन पार्ट 1 कुछ इस प्रकार से है दैट वेरीफाई दैट द नंबर गिवन अलोंग साइड ऑफ द क्यूबिक पॉलीनोमियल बिलो आर देयर जीरोस पहले तो हमें वेरीफाई करने हैं एंड आल्सो वेरीफाई द रिलेशन बिटवीन जीरोस एंड द कॉमन राइट इन ईच ऑफ द केसेस नाउ यहां पर जो हमें पॉलीनोमियल गिवन है दैट इज हैविंग डिग्री 3 उसके लिए हमें जो स्टैंडर्ड पॉलीनोमियल अज्यूम करना है वो भी डिग्री 3 का ही करना है सो दैट इज a x रेज टू द पावर 3 bx स्क्वायर माइनस plus cx and plus d so for that agar hum given of jo uh, aapke paas uh, polynomial hai uske agar values nikalte hain to a ki value 2 hai dono ko compare karte hain b ki value jo hai wo 1 hai aur c ki value jo hai wo hai minus -5 aur jo d ki value hai constant term ki value hai wo hai 2 so that's how we can say now we can put the value of uh, the given zeros into the polynomial polynomial is given by px which is px cube plus x square minus 5 x plus 2 now first of all we are going to put the first value there the value of x is 1 by 2 so we can frame it to 1 by 2 हम x की वैल्यू पुट कर रहे हैं यहां पर और प्लस 1 by 2 रेज टू द पावर 2 minus 5 to 1 by 2 and plus 2 that's how we can write it further we can solve it like uh, that will become 2 1 by a and that will become 1 by 4 because two is there plus here we can write 1 by 4 Right, and here we can write minus five by two and plus two. So that is equal to the LCM of the term. LCM of the term will comes out to be four. We can write one here. We can write again one here. Here we can write minus ten. Here we can write a. So after addition, all these we are having zero by four, which comes out to be zero. One by two is a zero of a given polynomial. Now here we are computing polynomial when the zero is one, just one. We can have again the same method we are going to do, and we are going to put the value one. Will be one two plus one square minus five to one and plus two. So it can be solved by two plus one minus five and plus two. If we add in all these things, so this is comes out to be zero. So this is the zero of the given polynomial. Another p minus two we have to compute. So again, we are going to put the value of x to dx. So we will put the value of x to dx. So we will put the value of x to dx. So we will put the value of x to dx. So we will put the value of x to dx. So we will put the value of x to dx. So we will put the value of x to dx. So we will put the value of x to dx. So we will put the value of x to dx. So we will put the value of x to dx. So we will put the value of x to dx. So we will put the value of x to dx. So we will put the value of x to dx. So we will put the value of x to dx. So we will Negative sign and plus two to the four and two plus ten and two plus two comes out to be zero. It means all three values are the zeros of the given polynomial. So यहाँ तक ये बात हमने prove कर दी है कि one by two 
start this do that at 1 by 2 1 and minus 2 are the zeros of the dx so that we proved now it means we are having we are having value of alpha that is 1 by 2 value of beta is 1 and value of gamma because there are three d zeros so we are having alpha beta gamma now the sum of sum of the zeros is alpha plus beta plus gamma that is equal to 1 by 2 plus 1 and plus minus 2 that comes out to be we have to take lcm this is 1 plus 2 and minus 4 fine so that is equal to uh, that is uh, 3 and uh, minus 4 this comes out to be minus 1 by 2 by formula we can write minus 3 by a so that is first step to get the relation between 0 and the coefficient next the product of all so that will be alpha into beta plus beta to gamma plus gamma into alpha in case of three zeros we have this relation so we are going to put the value of alpha then beta is 1 plus beta is 1 this is minus 2 and plus the gamma is minus 2 and alpha is 1 by 2. So after addition of all these next step will lead to 1 by 2 minus 2 and this will be uh, we are having minus 1 because these will cancel out after uh, addition of these two this will be minus 3 so this leads to uh, 5 by 2 with negative sign and this is nothing but p by a now another we are having alpha beta and gamma product of all zeros that is equal to 1 by 2 because hamare paas three zeros hain so we have to make p property so this will be minus 1 right so this will be 1 multiplied by minus 2 so this leads to minus 1 and that is equal to minus d by a so these are the relations for zeros and the coefficients and the three zeros are there We'll proceed further. We'll proceed further for the part two. For the part two, we are having we are having here part two. So part two is x cube minus four x square plus five x minus two. That is nothing but px for this part of the equation so we have to uh, as a, uh, again assuming the standard equation which is a x q plus b x square plus b x plus b so that is we have the value of a which is 1 value of b which is minus 4 value of c which is 5 and value of d which is minus 2 after comparing these two equations given equation with standard equation so we can calculate because we have prove ye karna hai ke 2 1 and 1 ye tino given polynomial ke zeros hain so hame teen values calculate karni hai yahan par polynomial p2 is zero or not polynomial 1 
पी वन इज जीरो और नॉट तो सबसे पहले हमें ये प्रूव करना है एंड देन पी वन तो बिकॉज One is a repetitive zeros argument, so we have to prove it two times. If one is proved, then another is also proved. Now put the value two in this equation. So this will be two raised to the power three minus four into two raised to the power two plus five into two and minus two. So that is equal to eight minus eight and this will be. Will be minus two to the four. Four to the sixteen, and this is plus five to the ten minus two. Fine. Right? So it is comes out to be eighteen minus eighteen. So that is comes out to be zero. Now for one, we have to put one raised to the power three minus four into one raised to the power two plus five. One and minus two. So this is one minus four plus five and minus two. This comes out to be six minus six. That is zero. This is zero. This is repetitive. This is zero. It means all are the zeros of the given polynomial. If it is so, then we can write three roots are there. Alpha is two, suppose, and beta is one, and gamma is Again, one. So these are the zeros of the given polynomial. So we can write alpha, beta, gamma in this form. So addition of addition of all the zeros is equal to two plus one plus one. That is comes out to be four. We can have the value of b because the formula is minus b by a. So the value of b here is minus four, and the value of a is one. So we have four. So this and this is fine. So another the product alpha plus beta, sorry alpha into beta and beta into gamma plus alpha into gamma is equal to two into one and plus. One to one plus plus, and we'll have two into one. This comes out to be two plus two plus one. So that comes out to be five, and that is nothing but c by a. You can just put the value of c. C is five, and a is one. So you can see that this value after coefficient and after simple multiplication of the Zeros are same. Now the product of alpha, beta, gamma will be two into one into one. So that it comes out to be two. And by formula, it is minus three by a minus three. That is minus the value of b here is minus two. So it will be minus two and divide by one. So value comes out to be one. So this value and this value is same. so this is the solution and verification uh, of uh, the polynomial having power having degree 3 so hope you like the video please subscribe the channel and do not forget to press the bell icon